listening to PTV and I'm here at Bloodstock Festival with Nuclear Blast UK and right now I'm here with Exodus, so... How you doing? Cheers. Um, when you were about to go on stage, you were introduced as the band that defined thrash metal. Uh, would you agree with that statement and how does that kind of statement make you feel? Well, I think it's probably part of a group of bands that, you know, helped define it, you know, back in the day. I mean, uh, there was you know, a handful of bands when this whole thing started, and I think probably Exodus was one of the bands that helped shape it in its early, you know, in its genesis, so. You know. All the other, the big four, all the, the big four bands agree it should be the big five, because Exodus was right there in the middle of all that, along with Metallica and, uh, and uh, Anthrax and Slayer, creating a genre of music that didn't exist before them, so. Mm -hmm. They all agree that it should be the big five. Yeah, a lot of fans have actually said it should be the Big Five, and many of them expressed their disappointment when they found out Exodus weren't being included in that package tour. Um, do, you, do you feel thankful that the fans show that kind of almost... Yeah, of course, you know, man. I mean, of course it's great to be considered by some, you know, to be connected with... I wish the tour with, with thought that. Bands, you know, and we got to go on it. That'd have been that'd have been better. But that, 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 to think that the fans like that and the you know the other bands think that it was just uh, I think it was you know, it's the big four became like a little thing rather than the big five. But at the same time, you know, back then in those days, that, those were the big four. I mean, they yeah. were they were called the big four way well, back in the eighties. Yeah. They were, and Exodus wasn't. And yeah. So it's not like we're. It's not like we were mad or anything about it. I mean, that's that's who they are. You know what I mean? It's really, so. It should be really called the big one and the other three. Yeah, exactly. You know? Because, because it's really a Metallica. Show. Metallica is like here, and all the other bands are here. You know? Yeah. And so according to you know the way it really is, but but uh, it's all good. It's still the big four. Um, when you were writing those albums back in the early '80s, which have now shaped an entire genre, did you have any idea that it would become? such a massive part of heavy metal music. Well, me and Rob weren't around in the early, we early weren't around. days, well, but I can I, tell you I can tell you what Gary said is they were just no. writing songs, that's yeah. all they had. They had no idea of anything they were doing except for, we're just going to go out and do what we do, and that's it. And they yeah. weren't thinking anything, they weren't even thinking two years down the line. No, no. They were thinking of this moment right now, da -da 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 -da, and that's it. So. Yeah, I, I agree. I, from all the stories and from what I gather from them, they were, it was just a moment in time and everybody was just doing what they do, you know what I mean? And it was one of those little communities of people and it, everybody caught on and it turned into something bigger than it was. In 2010, you released your album X of Exhibit B, The Human Condition, and it received a lot of critical attention. How does it feel to be getting that kind of critical response at this point? In your oh, it's great. I mean, it's good to be able to, you know, this late in a, in a career to still put out music that people, you know, like and consider consider fresh and want to hear. You know what I mean? Because a lot of bands our age really struggle trying to get music out that's relevant, you know, for the time and that, that young people like and the old fans like. It's not that easy of a thing to do, you know. So it's good. It feels good. Yeah. You know, we to be relevant. We owe it to Gary. I mean, Gary. Gary listens to a lot of you know newer bands, uh, a lot of the death metal and black metal, and uh, so I think his ear stays modern, you know, and uh, kind of helps you know helps it. So. And being one of the leaders of the thrash metal genre, one of the very first bands to play that style of music. What are your thoughts on the bands that have? really taking that genre into the modern era? I mean, it's good. I mean, it's metal's more popular than it's ever been, you know? So, I mean, I, I love, you know, I mean, I love the fact that it's becoming not not mainstream, but that it's becoming so big that, you know, everybody knows what it is and accepts it. And, you know, like everybody knows who Metallica is. And, you know, so, I mean, it's just kind of getting bigger and more people are hearing it and liking it. And that, that that's only good. Yep. I like some of the, a lot of the newer bands like Musical Waste, Warbringer. I mean, those guys are young kids who are playing this style of music and still keeping it fresh and doing their own thing and not just rehashing, you know, the same blah, 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 riff over and over again. So uh, I can appreciate that. You know, that those bands uh, still do that. You know? Yeah. Um, well, this is actually my last question. But what's next for Exodus? Is about? Uh, we're writing a. We're gonna record. 
record the beginning of the year, February, March. New new album with Andy Sneap doing the doing the production again, and uh, then we'll be back out here this next summer. You know, hitting yep. these festivals again. Yep. So and we'll yeah. milk it again for yeah. a couple of years. <laughs> I know that uh, I know that uh, they asked us to come back next year to here, so we'll be here next year with a new album, new songs, new set list. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's it. That's a plan. Yeah, it should be it should be good. You know, good. the future's wide open. Yeah. 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 Well, thanks so much. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, buddy. Oh man. Oh, man. Good questions, man. Whoa. 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 Whoa.